Section number two, baby. Gotta do a first wheelie in Colorado. This is just a fire road here. Nice little break, get some speed, get some wind to you. These fat tires, man, it's a big difference. Feels weird in the front. And back on the track. Whoops, man. Another thing I didn't expect. I like that, that was cool. First downhill section, I enjoy it. I like following with Lee, man. He's just cruising, just here to have fun, enjoy the views, and I'm right there with him. No point wearing yourself out, man. We're not racing here. And we're getting sprinkled on. Takes 100 out here. That was my first oops. These whoops are killer. Yep. A little bit of rain knocked the dust down. Let's go. Let's do this. Little disclaimer for everybody here, and for anybody for that matter, I am terrible with names. Like, it'll literally take me the next few days to just remember everybody's name. The personality, that's like the only thing that I remember is just the personality. Names and numbers, psh, right over my head. I know CCs and leaders, that's about it. For mixing gas and slapping ass. 
Got a little fly fishing, man. Diesel would love it out here. So I hope the audio is good enough. But guys, I was lucky enough to get to work with Electron a little bit and I was able to get one of their carburetors for this bike. And what that means is no jetting. It automatically meters for the altitude. So throughout the whole day, other than extreme lack of oxygen, it should run about the same. So far, I mean, look, this is first. Listen to first. Instant. Second. It's running fantastic. Zero complaints. For a trip like this, in my opinion, as you can see, what Slobodan earlier was struggling with his bike, still struggling to get it tuned. It's definitely running better now. And don't get me wrong, I know there's some jetting, you know, professionals, experts that can get it right every time and have experience doing it. But if, it's, if you don't want to mess with it, just get the Electron, man. Just put it in, go, enjoy your ride, not have to worry about it. Look at that. Oh my God, it's beautiful. little shortcut here no big deal gotta watch out for these hidden rocks man they will throw you into a world of hurt the biggest thing that I can say about being out here is just the feeling of pure freedom like absolute freedom like this is what America in my mind is supposed to be like just pure freedom getting out here away from everybody and Perfect conditions too. Zero dust, all grip for the most part, minus the rocks. Italian connector. No ATVs, baby, that's what I love. What are we running right now? 180. Neutral, no brakes.
this is gnarly. Yeah, this is some gnarly stuff. Beating you up. We are on the side of a cliff right now. That if you fall off, you're not going to have a good time. I don't think you'd get hurt on one like this. But I don't, I think you'd struggle to get a bike up. GoPro just doesn't do it justice. This will probably look just like Wayne. Love the suspension on this bike so far. Dude, line picking is fun. I'm having fun doing this. And sometimes you don't always pick the best one, but you just gotta ride it out and try to recover. That was fun. Yeah, he he took a bad line and like went right towards this log, and I had to go around him. This is awesome. Yeah, Italian job, man. I don't know. does fine. It's the rider. Hey, how's your rib doing? I'm doing alright as long as I'm not scarring too hard. Yeah. Also, the riding pace is a lot different than I expected. We get some sections where we pick up some speed, but for the most part, we're just enjoying it. And that's really what I wanted to do. I was worried that it was going to be hammer down, balls to the wall the entire time.
That was cool. This is the stuff that I've only seen in videos. Yeah. <laughs> a little bit, but that's my fault. <sighs> Falling too close. <sighs> yeah. These fing rocks suck. That is gnarly. Rocks and roots. Ah, I can't keep my front tire anywhere. Dude, I think they redid this truck. Hey, turn my fan up. I'm sliding everywhere. Yeah, I don't know. I thought it was just me then. No, it's slick. Jesus. I'm getting tossed off the trail every bump. Okay, so am I. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Whoops. I'm watching him. <laughs> my GoPro fogged up. A little bit on the bottom, but should be good. I haven't turned it on yet. I should have. I go to turn it on, and it somehow it gets in time warp. <laughs> I gotta get into my groove again, man. It seems like every time that I stop, I get out of the groove. What happened? This clutch ain't working. At all. Yeah, it's working, but as soon as I take off, it quit. What His clutch isn't working. I ain't got no clutch. I couldn't do it. So Levi has no clutch right now on the 450. Pretty much brand new. This is everything I could have imagined and more. This is absolutely awesome. <laughs> Neutral. And look how much energy I wasted by one mistake. He's 
These rocks, man, will wear you out and test you. But then you have sections like this where you can sit down for a minute, get some breath back. I know. After I changed your math, it quit working. Plus <laughs> dead. Damn it. Steve's fault. <laughs> I don't feel like it said anything though. I didn't get any air come out of it. You got like one drop. I'll have to suck on this. Just suck a little bit. Just a little bit. Yeah, it was it. <laughs> suck in the bucket? Yeah. <laughs> Stick your tongue in. <laughs> there. there. <laughs> nice. Should be it. Quality. This thing just come unclipped, whatever this. Oh, it's just for my GoPro thing. That didn't taste too bad. 